Hello, this is Jen Steed at Happy Little Homemaker and I have another Stitch Fix unboxing and I have to confess I haven't unboxed it yet but I did take a look at the cards and I'm kind of excited about this one. I'm really thinking this might be my first. I love everything in it. I have to buy it all um, but we'll see after I pull them out and try them on and I'm joined here by my lovely assistant, my seven and a half year old daughter who really really wanted to do this with me so um, she's going to be helping unpack the box and we'll see what's in here. So this is my fourth fix, I believe. My second one this month. And I've got a new stylist today. Um, and I requested some fall stuff and I adjusted the sizes of my shirts again because all the other stuff didn't quite fit right. And I adjusted my pants and I have no idea. So we'll just, we'll see how it works because I'm still trying to figure out what size I am and I keep losing weight all the time. So what worked last month might not work this month. So anyway, that is the deal. So we'll see what we've got. Would you do me the honors of opening up the first <laughs> bundle, my dear? rip into it, babe. Have her so careful. Mm -hmm. Alright, so I've got four things in this bundle. First, we have the Market and Spruce Cordella striped boat neck sweater. So it's just a striped, black and white striped sweater. It's a thin weight sweater. It looks like it's kind of long. And it looks like it's um, kind of on the big side. I did change my shirt size back to a medium, um, which is probably going to be good for layering and such because I don't know that I'd want a sweater skin tight. I don't know, maybe I would. We'll have to see. Next is a 41 Hawthorne. This is a three quarter sleeve popover blouse. And it's in black. And I'm pretty sure that my notes say no black by my face. I'm pretty sure I put that in my notes, no black shirt. So this might be the, uh, the extra that I don't really like too terribly much. I'm pretty sure. If this isn't the same shirt I got last time, it's really darn cool. Oh no, it's not. It's because the other one had um, brass details. But it's very, it's got very similar cut in the arms. <coughs> yep, that's it. So we'll have to see how that one fits. This one. Ooh, I like this. This is the uh, Matata Faux Suede Pocket Knit Top. So it's a knit color black shirt and the pocket is made out of suede. Ooh. Yeah, it's very soft. So we'll have to see how that one fits because like I said, I have no idea what size I am and none of my sizes ever seem to be right. This one, as usual, is a hand wash cold and I'm betting the other ones are hand wash as well. So I've got that. And then these are the Mid-Rise Alexa Skinny Jeans, and these look like they're, yep, they're in navy. So they are a navy skinny jean with a 27 inch waist. I you said you have don't look like it says four, so. I thought you got five things in the stitch fix. I do, there's another item in the box still, my dear. Oh, there's only one, two, three, four. There's another one in the box. And the one in the box is the one I'm really excited about because... You need a coat and that's a coat? Because I've been wanting a fall weight coat and I didn't really want to go out and get one. And I need a dress coat for church. And when I saw that I got this tweed wool coat, I was pretty excited to see it. This is... From the Pink Martin collection. And it is really a nice shaped coat. I really like it. It's a very 
feminine looking and it's got a very fun and collar and it's a like black and gray tweed and I really like it and it's in size medium and so I hope it fits because I've had, I've had bad like luck with tops and shirts in both sizes so I have no idea what this is going to do and it looks like it goes with the shirt yeah you could I could probably wear it with any of those Oh yep, they show the shirt with the with the with that color blocked shirt, don't they? So uh, I'm going to take some time and try these on, and I will take photographs, and hopefully they will turn out better than they did last time because last time they did not turn out very good at all. Um, so anyway, these are the five things I got from Stitch Fix. The total cost, if I keep the whole box is $284.50 if I get if I take the buy five discount that's three shirts a coat and a pair of jeans which is not bad so we shall see so that is my fix number four with stylus Ariel I think name, yeah by Ariel and so I will try these on and I will post pictures and thoughts and prices and names of the items and all sorts of fun stuff um, in about a week or so. Yep. So, see you next time. <coughs>